You've been hearing about cryptocurrency for a while now, and you want to get your feet wet by registering a new account with Gemini, one of the leading exchanges for the new cryptocurrency. But the registration process, necessarily thorough for security and verification, can seem complicated and daunting. In this video, we're going to walk you through the step-by-step -step process of registering for a U.S. Gemini account so that you can start easily and confidently participating in the new world of cryptocurrency. As you're watching, please feel free to stop the video anytime you need to repeat or fully understand a step. So let's get started. Remember, it's vital that you use your correct and valid information as it will be verified throughout the secure registration process. On the main web page, click the Open a Personal Account box. Your first task is to create your account by entering your account information. Type your first name, last name, email, create your password, and finally, after you've read the user agreement, make sure to click the I Agree checkbox and click Create Account. Gemini will now verify your email account by sending you a verification code to the email you've provided. If no email appears in your inbox, remember to check your spam or junk email folder. Open the email, note the code, return to the Gemini window and enter it into the provided field. You're now in the welcome page where we will continue to verify your account information. Click Get Started. You've already verified your email, so your next step is to verify your phone contact. Enter your country of residence, then your state of residence, and click Continue. On the next field, enter your phone number to have Gemini send a verification code to your phone. Enter the code in the verification window and your phone is now verified to your account. Gemini offers the use of the Authy app to generate authentic codes instead of relying on a short message service. Let's ignore this option for now and click I'll do that later. This next page asks that you verify your payment account. A pull-down menu with a number of mainstream banks will pop up. If you belong to one of these banks, your verification process will be quick and easy. When you click your bank's icon, you'll be asked for your bank's online user account and password. This will instantly verify your bank and you are ready to move on. However, if your bank is not on their list, you can still verify it once your Gemini account has been fully set up by making a USD deposit via wire transfer directly from your bank. For now, let's move on. The last step in setting up your account is to verify your identity and upload your documents. Fill in the required information on the personal information page. For your identification document, you can use either your passport or your driver's license. A student ID is not permitted. You can take a picture using your computer's camera or you can upload a picture taken previously by choosing it through your browser or dragging and dropping the file on the designated area. When your document is uploaded, Click Submit for Review. Identity verification generally takes two business days. Welcome to Gemini. As an added bonus, we're going to walk you through buying altcoin on Bittrex using your Gemini account. For this tutorial, we will assume you have already established a Bittrex account. First, from Gemini's dashboard, go to your Transfer Funds pull-down menu, pull down to Withdraw from Exchange, and select F. This will take you to a Withdraw F page. Ensure that the tab for F is highlighted. You'll be getting a destination address from Bittrex and pasting it in this field. Now log into your Bittrex account and select the Wallets tab. You'll know it by the Bitcoin symbol. In this window, type F in the search bar. It's important to understand that although we are dealing in F, Bittrex calls it Ethereum. They mean one and the same thing. Please do not confuse Ethereum with Ethereum Classic. Ethereum Classic is another blockchain. If you send your Ethereum to an Ethereum Classic wallet, you'll lose your funds. To obtain your Ethereum address, press the plus sign on the Ethereum row. A window pops up with your Ethereum wallet address. Highlight and copy this address. Now return to your Gemini Window F page and paste the Ethereum address in the Destination Address field. Indicate the amount of ETH you wish to withdraw from your Gemini account. Press Review Withdrawal and then Confirm or Send. Back in the Bittrex Account Balances window, your pending transaction should appear in this field within 10 or 15 minutes, possibly more depending on the blockchain traffic at that moment. To monitor the ETH market, 
Press on the Bittrex website's main symbol to visit the main page. Then scroll down until you see the Ethereum market. We are looking for the Basic Attention Token, or BAT, market. Search for BAT on this sheet, or type it into the search field. The Ether BAT market should appear. Press on the FBAT market indicator. Congratulations! You're now at the FBAT market. Here you can watch the market's progress and make financial decisions on your Ethereum accordingly. We hope this tutorial has helped you lay a positive foundation for your future experiences with Gemini. Thank you for watching.